Here is another interesting thinking application on limits. Evaluate limit of the function sine of cosine x over 1 over cos x. How are you going to do this? Now, what we will do in this case is we'll substitute 0 and then check our answers. We get what? We get limit x approaches 0. Well, so when we substitute, we don't normally write this. Anyway, let me write the question first. Sine of cos x over 1 over cos x. Correct. Now what I'm going to do here is, I'm writing 0 for cos x. Then what do we get? We get this function equals to limit. Again I wrote limit. Well, I shouldn't be writing. We'll substitute 0 here, okay? And then write down our answer. So we get sine of cos 0 over 1 over cos 0 okay have a good look at it what do you get what is cosine of 0 cosine of 0 is 1 so we get sine of 1 over cos 0 is 1 over 1 so the answer is sine 1 do you see that that is the answer for this question so we get our answer as sine 1 isn't that interesting wow